I have a question. It's... Perhaps we can take a closer look. Certainly. Lead the way. What can you tell me about this device? Great presser, was it? That is correct, senor. After primary fermentation, the mass is pressed through a fine filter, leaving only the flesh and skins behind. I should add that grape stomping, the iconic practice of crushing grapes with your bare feet, is historically rare and mostly a tourist gimmick. But you are most welcome to try. Imagine you're a grape. <laughs> Thanks. I'll pass. Oh, go on. I'll take a picture of the three of you. Oh, come on, Tamara. When in Rome. Fine. May I see that, Mr. Vargas? I believe I blinked. So, this is what the little guy feels like. Ah! No, all good. Looks like I what happened to your colleague? Urgent call. Something about work. I don't think she'll be coming back. Oh, well. I'm sure she can find her way out. Let's proceed. I'm interested in these containers. Ah, yes. Our large fermentation tanks are constructed from solid French oak and each contain up to 500 gallons of grey must. Interesting. Are those cooling sockets? They are indeed, Signora. The cooling system allows us to fine-tune the entire process. The temperature, humidity levels, etc. Our goal here at the NIH it's quite simple. With the state of the art by making facility to our carefully nurtured grape stock, hand-picked with loving care by local experts, we have only one purpose. To make the best Venus in Argentina and beyond. Well, looks like an accident waiting to happen. Occupational hazard. Eh, Burnwood? What can you tell me about this freezer? This can increase your cold storage unit or keep our excess grape stock to prevent decay. It easily reaches temperatures of minus 10 degrees Celsius. Trust me, you don't want to stay in here for long. No kidding. Hey, there's no doorknob on the inside. Seems like a pretty glaring safety omission if you ask me. Probably soundproof too. And good luck getting a phone signal. Such imaginations you have. But there really is no need to worry. Why? We haven't had an accident since Mrs. Yates' dog was run over by a grey picker. Anything else you wish to know? There's really no trouble. I got all I need. Are you enjoying yourself, Mr. Black? Oh, it's all very inspiring. One making is a grand Sure, sure, everyone... <laughs> Let's continue to the barrel room. Follow me. What can you tell me about this grape crusher? Well, as the name implies, it crushes the distilled grapes into a thick pulp or mass by a powerful rotating cylinder. She is one of the most important appliances in our production pipeline. Have you had any workplace accidents? What? Fall into the vat and get crushed to a pulp? You'd have to be a bona fide idiot. Waste of space, if you ask me. Yes, well, fortunately, we have had none of that. So if there's no further questions... Ah! <laughs> <sighs> 
Isn't someone else supposed to be doing this? Ah, contact. Urgent call. Something about work. I don't think she'll be coming back. Oh, well. I'm sure she can find her way out. Let's proceed. Thanks. I'll pass. Oh, go on. I'll take a picture of the three of you. Oh, come on, Tamara. When in Rome? Fine. Do I know you, hombre? Can you believe this guy? What a puto dildo. That's it. You're in trouble now. That's one in puto, cabron. You brought this shit on yourself. Remember that. Hey, hey, hey. What's with the costume? I'm onto you, idiot. What? What? Ah! 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 Ah!